Hey guys, welcome to today's video. Guys, in today's video, I wanna do my first impressions on the 10 fragrances from the Discovery set that I got from the brand Mind Games. So Mind Games is gonna officially drop in September. It's gonna be sold at Neiman Marcus. It's gonna be sold at Harrods. It's gonna be sold in Dubai. And of course, on soavantgarde.com. So if you want to know my first impressions on these 10 beautiful fragrances, because the decan skies are everything. I'm trying to get the, the top off of the box. So if you want to know about these 10 decants, right here, right here, then just continue to watch. Guys, before we get started with the video, please make sure you're subscribed to the channel. Make sure that red button turns gray tap that notification bell so you don't miss any of my uploads thumbs up the video so i know you love my content and finally leave me a comment below so we can get to know each other now let's get started with the video all right guys i don't have time to waste i want to get into it because the first two that i smelled when i did my haul i'm just so super excited because checkmate and kaisia i think that's the name of it has me in a chokehold already so i'm trying to get to the other eight so let's just get through this really, really quickly. So you'll be able to purchase Mind Games exclusively on NeimanMarkets.com and at Neiman Marcus stores come September 2022. It'll also be sold in Harrods. You'll be able to get it in Dubai and of course on SoAvantGarde.com. Now you're gonna get 10 mil decants in this limited edition discovery set that I suggest getting because honestly guys, if you're a fragrance lover, you need this. If you are a fragrance lover, you need this. This right here is just a beautiful expression of art and perfumery all at the same damn time. They're extra de parfums. They're 20% of oil concentration, guys. So you're getting 20% oil. So it's going to be strong and potent, but it's going to be enough alcohol because what? We love to project and why? We love to leave a scent trail, okay? So we're definitely going to need that alcohol, but you're getting enough perfume oil in it as well. Now, let's start with this one right here. This is called Gardez. And guys, you already know, I'm really not that good with the pronunciation, so bear with me. I'm so excited because Checkmate, y'all, ooh, and Kaisia. So I don't really have a bunch of notes, but I'll definitely be able to give you a little something. So in Gardez, we have Leather and Oris. So let's see. Oh, and I meant to show you guys. I told you guys that it's sustainable and reusable. Look at this. All you have to do is just pull it up. You can, you know, open this and refill it with your fragrance. And it's so super chic and cute to put in your purse. I just love it. Love, love, love. Now, I wish it came with um, like a microfiber cloth just to wipe off the fingerprints and the oil stains and stuff like that. But other than that, it's so super chic and so super cute. So let's get into Gardez. 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 I'm not sure how to pronounce it. Let's see. Okay, it smells, it smells kind of fresh and green. I definitely smell some smokiness in this one as well. I feel like this one definitely leans masculine. They're all unisex, but for me, this one leans masculine. I wanna wear this, but I can see a man smelling really sexy in this one. So this is, Gardez. Now, let's go to Double Attack. Woo! These names. Come on, Mind Games. Come on, somebody. Double Attack. Let's see. Okay, so Double Attack is citrus, woody, and edible. As it dries down, I can smell some type of a gourmand um, nuance trying to come through. But it's another one that's not for me. It definitely leans more masculine to me. But I definitely smell some type of a gourmand note peeking out in the back, like all the way like down in the base. Now that was, that was, that was a double attack right here. So now we have Jadoob. Jadoob. All right, let's see. 
Oh, okay. Now we talking. Now we starting to be on my street now. We are, oh, this is pomegranate and suede. Y'all, y'all know I love fruity and I love pomegranate and I've been loving suede lately. Oh, this is, I gotta put this one on my skin. All right. I don't have anything on just for the video. Let me do another little spray. Oh, Jadu. Yes. Yes. I love this. Yes. This is beautiful. Fruity. A little bit of suede. Like a nice, smooth, soft, creamy type of suede. This. Okay. I'm putting this on this side right here. Jadu. Two thumbs up. All right. So now we have Scholar's Mate. The Scholar's Mate. <laughs> oh, Scholar's Mate. Let's see this has it's a woody aromatic floral fragrance so let's see definitely woody very woody it almost smells like there's some type of spice in here maybe cinnamon it smells a little bit spicy and woody it's beautiful but not for me it's leaning more on the masculine side, so I'm putting it on, on that side right there. <laughs> All right. Now, the Grand Master, the Grand Master is this one right here. Grand Master is Rose um, Absolute and Coffee. Rose Absolute and Coffee for the Grand Master. Come on, Grand Master. Oh. Yes. Yes. The Grandmaster. Yes. Yes. A moment, a vibe. And the crazy thing is, it has Rose Absolute in coffee. It doesn't smell like Deluxe by Tiziana Terenzi. It doesn't smell like Intense Cafe. It smells like it's, oh my goodness. And as it dries down, it gets even better. Yes. Yes. This is going on this side. That's the Grand Master, honey. Yes. This is Checkmate. I already... <laughs> Y'all saw my reaction to Checkmate, but we're going to spray Checkmate again. Checkmate is all sprayed out, okay? Because Checkmate has been in heavy rotation round these parts. Mm. Sexy. Come on, mind games. Why are you playing with them like that? Stop playing games with them, mind games. Mm. Y'all, Checkmate. Checkmate is everything. What's in Checkmate? Tobacco, um, bourbon, and Santal. Checkmate is so super sexy, y'all. And you hear bourbon. Well, maybe bourbon. Um, It doesn't smell like boozy to me. It just smells super sexy. It has to be some type of vanilla. I'm wondering if it's bourbon vanilla or there, it's just like regular vanilla in here. Because there's something in here that's sweet. And I know tobacco can be sweet, but... It's a different type of sweetness. I feel like this is unisex, but it's like straight down the middle. A man can wear it. A woman can wear it. It's super sexy. Super sexy. Love. Oh, my goodness. Checkmate is everything. All right. Well, this is so much fun, y'all. All right. So now we have Castling. So Castling has... It's a woody, floral, fruity. It. I'm already like here for it woody floral and fruity yes i'm here for it okay it smells very green to me it's pretty it's it's nice it's nice but it's it's not me but it is nice though it's, it has like a freshness to it because I heard woody, floral, and fruity. But there's something, maybe there's a fig in here. Maybe like a green fig. It smells like a green fig to me. Yeah, I don't think strawberry fruity or, or mango fruity or pineapple fruity. I don't think that's the fruit that's in here. I think this is a fig. It smells a little bit green. And it's pretty, but it's not for me. But it is pretty. I can see somebody wearing it. So that was Castling. So now we have 
Kaisia. Yes, I know I love this one, y'all, because I smelled this one on my um in my haul video, and I was obsessed. Yes, still obsessed. So what's in this one? Because I didn't have the notes at that time. So this one is a floral woody. Love this, guys. Love this. Yes, love this. This smells like like the springtime. Like just walking through a garden in the spring in a nice, beautiful floral dress, a nice uh, straw hat with a loewe bag. It's that type of vibe. Like you're getting ready to go to a picnic, but you don't want to smell too girly and too feminine, but you want to smell like the season. That's what this smells like to me. This smells like spring. And that is Kaisi. No, right? Yeah. Is that how you say the name? Kais Kaisa. Chum. All right. So we have two more to go. So now we have Blockade. So in Blockade, we have... It's a woody, leather, fruity fragrance. Ooh. Let's see. Woody, leather, and fruity. Yes. This is different for me. This is so different for me, but I love this. It has like a... It, I can't put my finger on it, but this smells... It smells like there's some type of herb in here. Like maybe like a thyme. There's something aromatic in this fragrance. What is this? This is blockade. Woody, leather, and fruity. It smells like there's something aromatic. It smells like thyme. It smells like fresh thyme. But I love it though. It's different for me because it's not something that I would usually um, like. But this is, I love this. And as it dries down, it gets sweeter. Yes, this is really pretty y'all. So this is going on this side right here. At the end of the video, I'm gonna like share with you guys my favorites. So now we have the last one and this is Asuli, As Asuli's Diamond. Ooh, what's in this? So this is a woody aromatic incense. So let's see. Ooh. Let me tell you something. All these fragrances smell like money. This just smells like rich. Like, it just smells like money. Wow. 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 Okay. So in my favorites, I have Asuli's Diamond. And then we're going to break down my favorites in my favorites. So right now we have Asuli's Diamond, Kaisia, Jadub, Grand Master. The Grand Master. We have Checkmate and we have Blockade. Now, Checkmate. I need a full bottle. Blockade, I need a full bottle. The one with pomegranate, which one was that one again? The pomegranate and leather, Jadub. I need a full bottle. Kaisia, I need a full bottle. And I think it was the Grand Master, the Rose Absolute and Coffee, need a full bottle. Now, this one, the Asuli's Diamond, I feel like I can just rock out with the decant and be good. You know, I would finish this decant before I would consider getting a full bottle. But let me tell y'all something. So out of 10, right? Oops. Out of 10 decants, see? 10 that you would get. I am in love with one, two, three, four, five. So that's why the discovery set makes sense because let's say you didn't want to get the full bottle of one of the fragrances. You have 10 fragrances that you can absolutely wear and absolutely play with. Like honestly, all of them are beautiful. There's three, no, there's four that lean more masculine to me that I'm gonna pass on to Bay. But the six I'm gonna be wearing and the five I need full bottles of. So that's why it's good to get the discovery set, guys. It is limited edition. If you're interested in the discovery set, shop my link in the description box below. Let me tell you something about these fragrances. I smell, I don't, I'm not gonna sit here and say I smelled all the fragrances in the, like it, I have not smelled a whole lot of fragrances like that. But 
in my travels, within my fragrance journey, the fragrances that I have smelled, I have not smelled anything like the ones that's on this list right here. These 10 fragrances, nothing reminds me of anything else out there. And I'm so happy about that because it's like Baccarat Rouge 540, Delina, and um, Killian's Love Don't Be Shy, and also Intense Cafe by Montal. Those fragrances have such strong presence like within the fragrance community fragrance world that so many other fragrances smell very similar to them these fragrances out of all these 10 fragrances don't remind me of anything okay they smell like their own fragrance they smell like luxury they smell like pure money like you walk into a room wearing any of these fragrances and people are going to be looking at you like who that where they come from like who is that person because you smell like you don't belong there you know what i mean like you smell like money you smell sophisticated you smell fresh you smell clean you smell different people are going to smell you let me tell y'all something the checkmate when they smelled that he was like whoa like what are you wearing and i didn't have him smell um kaisia yet he only smelled checkmate because i have been wearing checkmate but i'm gonna be wearing these fragrances guys they are absolutely amazing like i said there's only a thousand of them made guys i suggest getting them because even if you don't want a full bottle of the fragrance you have 10 8 mil decans to play with so you can really sit and live with the fragrances even longer because honestly i'm gonna play with um there was one of them in the group that i said was masculine that i felt like it was unisex but leaned masculine that i'm gonna play with it for a little while wasn't this one castling i think it was castling the woody floral fruity i think it was this one you'll have them to play with so you can really get to see because it is pretty it is pretty y'all see i have to put this on my skin and wear it because this smells like money okay casting i think casting is gonna be yeah so now that makes seven that i actually want yeah that's sad but anyway let's talk about it in the comments below like we always do remember mind games y'all is changing the game they're not out here playing with y'all okay it's not a game <laughs> let's talk about it in the comments below guys remember to stay safe be great stay great and always strive for greatness AI The Great signing out, but I'll see you in my next video. Peace.